Hello everyone. So in this video, we will learn how to send telegram messages on newly created WooCommerce order. So imagine this, a new customer called as John has made a purchase from your WooCommerce store. So you want to notify your team members on telegram about this purchase. So here you have two choices. The first choice is you can copy all the details from WooCommerce, compose a message and send it on telegram. So the problem with this approach is it's actually very repetitive and tiresome because every time a purchase is made in WooCommerce, you actually have to do all those things manually to send a message on Telegram. So the second approach is I suggest you bring in some automation. So here, when a new order is created in WooCommerce, it will automatically send a message on Telegram. So in this video, we will be using Pabri Connect to integrate WooCommerce and Telegram. The best part of using Pabli Connect is there is no need for coding skills or programming knowledge. It can be done easily. Let me show you on my screen. Okay, so to begin the process, first type pabli.com in your browser. Pabli.com, press enter. Okay, so this is the website of pabli.com. Here hover on products. And here you will find the option called as connect. Click on connect. And then just click on sign in. Okay, so this is the dashboard of Public Connect. As you can see, I already have made an account in Public Connect. You can also create your own free account in just two minutes. Here, I would like to mention one more thing that Public Connect offers a plan where this integration can be tried out absolutely free. So you just have to clone the template of its workflow, which is available in the description box. Once you clone the template, you will get immediate access to this amazing workflow in your account. Okay, so scroll down and here you will find connect. Just click on access now. Okay, so at the top right corner, you will find a button. Create workflow. Click this. A dialog box appears in front of you. It is asking you to give a name to this workflow. I am going to give it as WooCommerce to Telegram. WooCommerce to Telegram. And then just click on create. Okay, so when you click on create, a window appears in front of you. This is called as the trigger window. So in the choose app, how about we make it as WooCommerce because we want to send the data from WooCommerce. That is why. Now in the trigger event, how about we make it as new order created. This one. Okay, so new order created is a trigger event. So your obvious question is what is a trigger event? Trigger is basically a if statement. It asks a question if the condition is met, what should be done? For example, if a new order is created in WooCommerce, then what action should be taken by the system? Actually, there are many more trigger events like a new order, new order updated, new customer created, customer coupon restored, coupon deleted, and so on. All of them are a bunch of trigger events. Now, in case if you want more triggers of your choice, you can make a request to our team at admin at the rate pabli.com for the specific trigger that you want to build. But at present, I just want to send the data when a new order is created in WooCommerce. Okay, so basically the gist of the process is we are just trying to integrate WooCommerce to Pabli Connect. So let me take you to my WooCommerce account. So as you can see, this is my WordPress account and WooCommerce as a plugin has been installed in it. So first of all, I'm going to click on settings. Click here. Okay, so this is the settings page of WooCommerce. So the right side, you will find the option called as advanced. Click this. Okay, so this is the advanced page here. You will find the option called as webhooks. Click this. Okay, so this is the webhook page. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to create a new webhook. So just click on add webhook. Okay, so first of all, let's give a name to this webhook. I'm going to give it as WooCommerce. WooCommerce to Telegram. Telegram. Okay, so of course you can give any name according to your discretion, but I'm just giving a very professional name, WooCommerce to Telegram. Now in the status, how about we make it as active? Now in the topic, we want to send the data when a new order is created. So let's make it as order created, order created, this one. Now this is the most important part, the delivery URL. So to get the delivery URL, let's go to Public Connect and copy this. This is the webhook URL or the delivery URL you want. Copy this and simply paste it here. Okay, so we have entered the delivery URL. Now coming to this part called as the secret, let's leave it as blank. Now the API version will remain same. Just click on save webhook. 
okay so it is showing the webhook has been created successfully so basically this means that woocommerce is now thoroughly integrated with public connect this means anytime a new order is created in woocommerce public connect will capture the data so as to ensure that public connect captures this data let me just click on this button capture webhook response click this okay so it is showing it is waiting for the data so what i'm going to do here is i'm going to make a dummy purchase in woocommerce okay so assume that a customer is making a purchase so i'm going to click on products all products okay so here you will find all the products that is uh, present in my woocommerce store so imagine this a person is uh, purchasing this product so let's say he is going to purchase this product oneplus phone so i'm just uh, clicking on view okay so now the person is just uh, going to add this to the cart okay and uh, then after adding to the card he's just going to click on proceed to checkout so this product is uh, oneplus phone and it's worth uh, 45000 rupees so just tell click on proceed to checkout so the person is just uh, buying the product okay so these are the details of uh, this guy so let me just uh, enter some details i mean so this is the person who is purchasing the product the first name is uh, aaron the last name is manuel and the company he is working is in tesla okay and this is the region where he resides and this is the street address this is his uh, address this is the city this is the state this is the pin code and of course this is his phone number and this is his email address so basically we are purchasing as a dummy customer called as aaron so what i'm going to do here is i'm just going to click on place order okay so order has been placed by this guy called as aaron manuel so let's have a look in public connect since it is uh, integrated with woocommerce has it captured this data or not so let us check okay so it is showing it is uh, still waiting for the data give it one or two seconds okay so as you can see the webhook response it has been is showing all the details so we have the name as aaron the last name as manuel the company he works is uh, tesla this is the address 196 sector 2 shakti nagar this is the address line 2 shakti nagar and this is of course the city this is the state this is the postal code this is the country this is the email and this is the phone number okay so basically we are planning to notify our team members about this particular customer on telegram now to send all this data to telegram all you have to do is uh, just click on this plus button okay so when you click on this plus button another window opens up this is called as the action window so in the choose app how about we make it as telegram okay telegram it is telegram bot okay so now in the action event how about we make it as send a text message or a reply now send a text message or a reply is an action event there are many more action events like edit a text message delete a message pin a message and pin a message all of them are bunch of action events now just like the triggers if you have trouble finding the action events according to your choice you can make a request to our team at admin at the rate public.com to custom build an action event for you but at present i just want to send a text message or a reply in telegram okay so just click on connect with telegram so in the new credentials we have to fill in this token so to get the token let's have a visit to uh, telegram so what i'm going to do here is uh, here in the search i'm just going to type bot father bot father this one okay okay so now bot father is now listening to our text so what i'm going to do here is i'm just going to create a new bot so i'm just going to type this uh, characters new bot okay excellent okay so i have got a reply from bot father so it's saying that all right a new bot how are we going to call it so basically we have to give a name to this new bot so what i'm going to do here is i'm going to give a name of my company that is uh, public connect integration of course you can give any name according to your discretion i'm just going to give it as public connect integration so let's check okay so now that uh, this uh, name has been accept accepted we have to give a username for this bot okay so i'm going to give a name called as uh, how about random one two three okay and uh, of course underscore bot now always remember you sh your bot name the bot username should always end with uh, these words uh, these alphabets b o t i mean bot okay so it's done so let's check is it available okay so this uh, bot name is not available so let's try some other um, how about we go with the integration name so this is about uh, woocommerce woocommerce and uh, telegram so this is the bot name woocommerce telegram underscore bot so let's check is this username for bot available okay yes this uh, username is available so as you can see here we have uh, the token so this is the token that we want to uh, enter here so what i'm going to do here is i'm just going to copy all of this okay copy this and i'm just going to paste it here okay so we have entered the token so just click on save to uh, connect public connect to uh, telegram 
Okay, so as you can see, when you connected Pebble Connect to Telegram, a set of blanks has appeared in front of you. The purpose of these blanks is very simple. We are going to construct a message from the data that we have received from WooCommerce. So as you can see here, we have the chat ID. So basically, we want to get the chat ID. Now to get the chat ID, we basically have to create a group. Now to create a group, it's actually very easy in Telegram. So first of all, I'm just going to click on these three horizontal bar. Then I'm just going to click on new group. Okay, so just... Uh, add a person so i'm going to add a person uh, bot i'm going to add my own bot pably connect integration so pably connect integration okay so this is the name so we have selected this particular person i mean the bot now it is asking me to create a group so the name of the group should be something like uh, woocommerce order data Okay, so this is the group name WooCommerce Order Data. So let me just check, click on create a group. Okay, so a group has been created. Okay, so in the next step, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to give admin privileges to my newly created bot. Now, there is something you should know that uh, this is the web version of Telegram. And in the web version of uh, Telegram, you really can't bestow admin privileges to your bot. You usually have to use your app on your mobile phone or the app on your desktop. Now, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to use the app. Okay, so I'm going to use the Telegram app. So this is the group WooCommerce order data and this is the bot Pabli Connect integration. So I'm just going to right click and I'm just going to click on promote to admin. Now this is the same step that you can do it on your mobile. But unfortunately, I repeat again, you can't do it on the web version of Telegram. You actually have to download the app on your mobile phone or your desktop. So here in the custom title, just type admin. Admin it is and just click on save. Okay, so as you can see now it is showing has access to messages and when we just click right click again it is showing edit admin privileges admin rights. So basically our bot has been bestowed as a new admin. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to minimize this. Okay, and uh, I'm going to add one more member to my group. So I'm just going to click here. I'm just going to click on invite member. So let's say this is my friend. Okay, so this is the person I actually want to notify when a new order is made in WooCommerce. So I'm just adding her to the group and let me just refresh this. Okay, so let's see. Do we have three members? Yes, we have three members. Excellent. So now coming to this part called as the chat ID. So this is our chat ID. So basically all we have to do is we just copy all these characters up to here. Do not include the S. Copy this and simply press paste it here. Okay, so there is something you should know. This is not the complete chat ID. Now just bring your attention to this part, message to private channel. And just look and just uh, bring your attention to here. Okay, use minus 100 and rest of the ID that we have got from Telegram web. This basically, okay. So all you have to do is in front of uh, these characters, just uh, add minus and 100, excellent. So our chat ID is ready, okay. Now coming to the text message, all we have to do is we have to map all the details from WooCommerce. Now to do that, just click on this uh, mapping button. This button is called as the mapping button. So when we click this, it will uh, show all the details that we have got from WooCommerce. So let me just uh, type in the message something like uh, uh, new customer created. And the name of the customer is uh, Aaron. And so we have mapped it. And uh, this is the last name, I think, Manuel. Okay, new customer created, Aaron Manuel. And uh, for entering a new line, all we have to do is uh, just enter slash and N. Okay, so we have, so we are going to create a new line. So in the new line, has purchased, has purchased or has, has ordered. Ordered is more appropriate has ordered so i think it was a oneplus phone so here you can search what he has bought that is oneplus phone has ordered one for the plus phone and uh, again we can enter uh, slash n okay so to create one more uh, line so in this uh, third line we are just going to map in the address he lives in and just map in the address so this is the address Okay, so that's uh, sufficient new customer created Aaron Manuel has ordered uh, one plus phone he lives in this address. Of course, you can customize your message according to your discretion. It's actually very easy. Now coming to the parse mode, let's keep it as HTML in the disable notification. Let's keep it as no in the disable link previews. Let's keep it as no. Okay, so when I click on save and send test request, it will send uh, this message. 
okay this message to telegram so let me just uh, click on save and send first to show you okay so the message has arrived so let's have a look directly in telegram okay so this is the message okay so new customer created aaron manuel he ordered one plus phone he lives in 196 sector 2 shakti nagar excellent so the presence of uh, this message shows that we have successfully integrated woocommerce and telegram with help of public connect so how about we double check if our integration is working fine or not but before we do that let me show you the whole mechanism in a nutshell so what i'm going to do here is i'm going to minimize this action window okay and I'm going to minimize the trigger window. So basically, this is the whole process in a nutshell. First, you integrated WooCommerce to Pabli Connect, and then you have integrated Pabli Connect to Telegram. So now there is a perfect flow of data between WooCommerce and Telegram. Okay, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going back to the products, okay, and assume that another customer is going to make a purchase of uh, this particular product, that is Chemistry Books. So the customer is uh, going to click on Add to Cart, and then he is going to click on Proceed to Checkout. Okay, so here he is going to fill in some details. So this is the new person that is uh, Lijim O'Reilly and he works in uh, Apple store. He works in, he lives in India. So these are all the details. The state is uh, kept as Madhya Pradesh. Okay, so let me just uh, click on place order. Okay, so as you can see, a purchase has been made by this guy called as Lijim. So let's have a look in uh, Telegram. Do we have the notification considering the same? So let me just uh, refresh this. Okay, so this is the notification new customer created, Lijam O'Reilly. He has ordered chemistry book. He lives in S10 Guitar Lane. Excellent. So our integration is working absolutely fine. This means anytime a new order is created in WooCommerce, it will be reflected as a message in Telegram. Not just these two apps, you can integrate up plenty of applications using Pabli Connect. If you have any queries, contact us at admin at the rate pabli.com. Our dedicated team members will help you to automate your workflows. Or better, just visit our website www.pabli.com. It's awesome. Thanks.